If she sticks your head in the water. Uh -huh. Good girl, bring it here. Good dog, bring it here. Get your knee, bring it here. Good girl, yes. Good girl. Good dog. Wow. It's a good sized carp. Good girl. Right here. Yes, get it. Good girl, get over it. Good girl, get over it. Good dog. Good girl. Get over it. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Bring it here. Bring it here. Good girl. Bring it here. Good girl. I'll go down. Shuni. Like the catching, if I could just keep hold of them. Back. You can even have them right in your hands and they just slide right off. Yep. You got them perfectly in your cradle in your hands and they just come right out. We need teeth. <laughs> like the dog. Or a leaf would be better than that. Yeah. Good girl! Good girl! Bring it here! Bring it here! Good girl! Yes! Good girl! Bring it here! Good dog! Oh, good girl! She just sunk her teeth into it. Yeah. Good girl! Good dog! You're gonna call you bear. Good girl! Good girl! Good Good girl! Good dog! She's gonna call you bear. Catching fish like a bear. Bring it here! Bring it here. Get on it. Good girl. Okay, good girl. Good dog. Okay, let's go find the secret anymore. So I like doing this so that uh, not to catch fish, obviously. I mean, I'm never really realistically going to expect Shuni to go out and just catch fish. I mean, Ulta actually did a few times, but even her, as good as Ulta was, it was more luck. Well, actually, that's not true. It was a lot of luck and a lot of skill. Um, but it wasn't just skill like she had to have just the right fish and just the right situation just the right water For her to actually have success everything had to align for her to have success So I mean it's not like a mink where you go out and actually intend on catching fish with the dog um, It's more of an accident while you're out doing something else and fish is in a vulnerable situation. You're like sweet go grab it, <laughs> you know um, But this does teach her some viable skill valuable skills being able to stick her head under the water, feel comfortable doing that, can be very useful catching muskrats. That's what she, um, that's what Onsa used to be really good at, was diving in and grabbing a muskrat that was swimming away. And so by teaching her the same concept on fish, which are five times harder to catch than a muskrat, um, it teaches her that concept and that skill. Muskrats are not only not as quick and nimble in the water as a fish, but the, the hardest thing about a fish is just getting a hold of it right because they're slippery especially these big old carp They've got hard scales and a hard head and the dog grabs them and they just slide right out of their mouth uh, Muskrat's got fur and feet and tail all these things to grab a hold of now If you're really wanting to dive into mink and learn the nitty-gritty details I would strongly recommend you read my book the new sport of minkinry if you would like to support us, you can buy a shirt or hat, or consider becoming one of my faithful patrons. Just go to the links in the description below.